In this video, I will show students how to complete a PDF that has been made fillable by their teacher and assigned to them inside Microsoft Teams. So I'm in my assignment right here. Uh, the instructions are to complete the graphic organizer, which is a fillable PDF that my teacher made. Uh, if you click these three dots, there's three options. The first two do not work. If I click open in Teams, it will open right here but it will not let me type anything into this document. If I choose open online, also it'll open in a new tab, but again, I'm not able to type into this document. Instead, I need to download the file to my computer. So I click the third option, which is download. It appears at the bottom of my screen. Click the little up arrow, show in folder. Here's my downloads folder. Here's my PDF. I want to make sure that I'm opening this with Adobe Acrobat Reader. When I open it with Adobe Acrobat Reader, you'll see that fields where I can type are not now highlighted in blue. So anywhere there's blue, I can type and it will appear on the document. And as you can see, it'll automatically go down to the next line <clears throat> and I can just type into all the spaces that my teacher wants me to type into. When I'm done I need to click File, Save. It'll ask me where I want to save it, somewhere that you easily can get to, so either your desktop or the downloads folder. I'm going to choose the downloads folder. So now my original files in here I need to rename it maybe by adding my name at the end so that it's different than the original. This is the blank one. This is going to be the one that has my answers typed in. I click Save. Now I go back into Microsoft Teams. Sorry, wrong window. I go back into Microsoft Teams. You'll see this button right here that says Add Work. I'm going to click Add Work. It's going to ask me where is this. I'm going to upload it from my device. So I click Upload from Device. And then I go into my Downloads folder. And remember, now I have two files here. I have the original file that's blank. And then I have the new one where I added my name at the end. This one has my answers in it. So I click Open. I let it load. And then I click Done. And now under My Work is my file where my answers are. And to double check, I can click these and hit open in Teams and just see what my teacher will see. And you'll see my teacher will see my document here with my typed in answers. So I know that it's good and I can click turn in.